Firstly, I'm Mike Collett. Yep. This is a 1966 Jaguar E-Type fixed head coupe. Uh, it's a Series 1 car, and in fact it was one of the last Series 1 cars built in late 1966. I actually discovered the car in Tasmania. Uh, it was one of those vehicles that was in an advertisement. I invited my wife to have a weekend in Tasmania, <laughs> and uh, en route I actually explained to her that we were going down to see an E-Type Jag. And so, um, having seen the vehicle, this is some 12 years ago now, um, the, uh, the car was in fairly good condition, but tired, and uh, in the 12 years since the car was acquired, the engine drivetrain, the IRS at the rear of the car has all been fully rebuilt. Uh, a lot of the panel work has been adjusted. It required quite a bit of fettling to doors, as Jaguars often do, and um, so much of that has been done in recent times. The paintwork is pretty much as it was, with the exception of the paintwork along the flanks. The paintwork along the flanks has had to be redone due to the fact the doors needed re refettling. Okay, so have you done a lot of this work yourself? Uh, very little on this one, Jeff. I have restored cars previously, MGs and Minis. Uh, with this one, I just haven't had the time, and so much of this has gone out to professionals. Any particular professionals? Yeah, look, uh, Anthony Ardito at uh, Ardito, Tony Ardito Automotive mm -hmm. rebuilt the engine, the drivetrain, and the differential, and did an absolutely superb job. The panel work in recent times has been done uh, by uh, some, uh, Seven Hill Smash, and uh, Kevin Tran and his team there have done a remarkable job on the door fit. Right, very important on these. So do you use the car a great deal now? The car is used every week. Every week? Every week. That's pretty yeah. good. What sort of things do you use it for? Um, club outings, uh, although infrequently in recent times, uh, but running down to get the paper, the milk, <laughs> any excuse to get behind the wheel. All the important stuff. All the important stuff.